weekend started with a few of designers. I got it as a present to my birthday uh, for my girl. What pissed me a bit off is increasing of prices. This 100 milliliter bottle, they charge twice as more for that. The main notes here are rum, spices and tobacco. The mid notes are leather, iris and tuberose. And the base notes are quiet wood, benzoin and uh, tonka beans. Overall, it's more refined, more mature, denser version of the Spice Bomb. Bulgari, Men in Black and the Spice Bomb EDT are for the guys who are bored with light summery fragrances. I really like the EDT Olivier Porsche. I like it simply for everyday wearing for the late, uh, late summer, fall season. Pretty easily wearable, nothing clashing here to me. Uh, as a designer, it's good to invest money into this fragrance, so I'm a fan of Spice Bomb for a couple of years. The, the spices and the powderiness and the, uh, the hint of the leather, leatheriness here, pretty easily understandable for everyday use. Like everybody knows, Santa Major School, the rose and sandalwood are very original. I have three of my face from the collection and those are the Ambre Sultan, Santa Major School and Shergi. These three are enough to me from his collection because they're more into the uh, male side and the Santa Major School has something to offer. When I spray it, it constantly gives me that presence of uniqueness uh, of the high quality notes here and refined warmth here. And look at the color. Damn. I think it's worthy buying that and at least try it. Go and try that one. The perfume Nikolai uh, fragrances are very refined, very noble, very sophisticated, very high quality ingredients inside of the perfume. Smell refined, very classy, formal handshake and that's uh, how you can imagine the smell of the perfume Nikolai. The Ambre Kashmir Intense and Caravan Serai Kurkuba Intense. Even the New York Intense. These four ones are somehow, to me, their smell more interesting than some of the mouths, for instance. I say it quite openly and because I want to make uh, authentic reviews, see how it feels to me. The smell takes me to the completely different zone. Like uh, you instantly know you have sprayed the high quality ingredients. If you bored with the, all those spice bombs and Bulgaris and Chanel's, go and try Parfum de Nicolai. I think it will be mind opening and opening the new journeys and how to like fragrance it's like it's like to like something new that you never met before the combination of the high ingredients and the notes that i expected from the professional perfume with no compromise and with no commercial trends she's putting the 1000 effort to create the original and one of the most unique and most original perfumes that I've met and that I've smelled and since I started to collect the perfumes. Ambre Kashmir Intense is something that I want to spend much more time with. Another uh, that I like very much and it's a new one, the recent fragrance from uh, Parfum de Nicolai and it's the Caravan Sarai. I highly recommend this fragrance. Coffee Plum Cardamom uh, Desert well and precisely done. There's no weak fragrance there in the whole line from the Parfum de Nicolai. What I have as, a, as a, another one, and it's something special with the Ponte Vecchio, Old Bridge, and it really smells like uh, the old or vintage bridge covered with the moss and with that the kind of the greenness. It has the green old stones covered with the, with the a bit of mossy and a bit of the grassy 
that's still very refined. I'm blown away with the Novio 1942 because of the uniqueness. They bring something fresh and new on the table that you haven't met before and that you haven't smelled before. It's really refined fragrance, the, the Ponte Vecchio. Here are the Novio uh, 1942 Rudy's, Rudy's perfume. It reminds me of that Libre de Orange a bit. Um, the scent is called Rien or Rien Incense Intense. Perizione Nobile 1942 here. It's more sweet and it's towards, to me, it's more leaning towards feminine side. So I'll give it to my girl because she likes it. Uh, Il Capriccio Maestro. It's very gourmandy and very sweet. It reminds me of Sergio. 1888 very much so so it depends on you uh, what you want to choose if you prefer Zerzhov 1888 or if you want to go and try or if you want to go to discover Il Capriccio Mastro uh, I can recommend you if you like uh, Zerzhov 1888 you'll definitely will like the Il Capriccio Mastro as well so I recommend you to try that one. Novil 1942 Il Capriccio del Mastro.